50 Winds, WHNZ. Now, live in studio, your host, local real estate expert, Jamie Maloney. Hi, thank you for joining us. My name's Christina Griffin. Myself and Stella Guticelli will actually be hosting the show today. Jamie is away at the Coldwell Banker National Convention in L.A., all expenses paid trip because he's in the top 10 in the nation for NRT. Um, we are on 1250 wins every Monday at noon. The Jamie Maloney real estate show, your information source for the Tampa real estate market. Today in studio, we have John Mitros, national renovation manager at movement mortgage and bud Springs. And we're also going to have two call-ins from Malcolm Tennant and Bill Lavender. Hi, Stella. How are you doing today? I'm excellent. Uh, quite a change. Uh, great to have you uh, with us uh, mm -hmm. uh, today. And thank you for replacing the voice of Jamie. <laughs> well, it's finally fall, so it, it's actually a really beautiful day in Florida. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, actually, I wasn't that happy yesterday when I opened my door to go outside. It was a surprise. Mm -hmm. What a drop of temperature, right? Oh, it was nice, though. Nice. Yes. I've been waiting for uh, it. Uh, uh, uh. I like the warmth of Florida. <laughs> well, we're in the 70s, so that's great. I believe we have Bill Lavender, who is uh, ready to to talk with us today. Sure. Yeah, so uh, Bill is on the phone um, uh, with us uh, this afternoon. Uh, Bill Lavender um, has started this company named Credit Restoration Services 15 years ago. And we're always grateful to have Bill on the show as he has uh, over 30 years of experiences in financial and credit businesses with a strong financial service background, having owned a mortgage company for many years. Bill has become very familiar with the requirements of the various loan programs and how to manage and for some of us improve our credit rating from the various bureaus. And my favorite name for Bill is Mr. Credit. Good afternoon, Dr. Credit. Good afternoon, Stella and Christine and, and uh, the fellows in the studio, but I haven't had a chance to meet you, but I'm looking forward to it. Yes, right. sir. We'll be getting together. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, Dr. Credit, I uh, wanted to discuss this uh, with you and uh, the listeners this afternoon. Um, I have introduced you last week to one, one of my clients. Um, the situation was that he sold his house a year ago. He paid his first mortgage and did a short sale on his second mortgage, still paying off a subsequent amount. And surprisingly, the short sale only appeared on one of the reports from the credit bureaus. So my first question to you is why only one credit bureau shows the short sale and not the other major, major credit um, agencies? Well, first of all, I have to answer that by saying I have not had a chance to look at the credit report, so I can only, only guess. Uh, first of all, Credit reporting is voluntary. Secondly, there are three credit bureaus, Experian, TransUnion, and Equifax, and uh, they're not free and they're not cheap. For a business or a company to report anything to a credit bureau, they have to be a member in good standing. Um, they have to undergo a, a screening process. They pay uh, a number of different fees to be an ongoing member, plus they have to pay for any services that are provided, such as reporting uh, these accounts. So the first reason could simply be, uh, and I'll give you a local example, could simply be that maybe they don't belong or are members of all three credit bureaus. We're seeing that more and more as a cost-saving measure. To give you an example, everybody in this area is familiar with Badcock Furniture Company. Mm -hmm. They choose, uh, for financial reasons, primarily to belong only to Equifax. So I tell people, if you've got a Badcock account, it'll help your, uh, your Equifax, but it won't show up on the other two. The second reason could be uh, we're talking now about... Uh, a second mortgage that was properly recorded in the county public records and uh, the majority of the information 
that goes on credit bureau reports are actually provided by third-party vendors who are uh, paid by the various credit bureaus to scan information, retrieve it, and send it to them. And uh, sometimes it doesn't; these things don't always get picked up by those third parties. So there's, there could be several reasons why it only appears on one. I understand. So now I was also wondering, having uh, a, for, um, a short sell lien on a second mortgage, is that a better situation than having it on the first mortgage? Well, that particular question is a, a hard question to answer. Mm -hmm. uh, legally, a first mortgage takes precedence over a second mortgage. So uh, in the case of a sale, the first mortgage is going to take priority. And when you're talking about foreclosures and short, short sales, for example, in a foreclosure, which I know this was not, uh, many times we see the first mortgage was foreclosed on, the property taken, uh, but the second mortgage uh, reverts to an uh, unsecured note because it's still there and unpaid. In this particular case, as I understand it, he sold his house uh, a year ago and paid off the for first mortgage, and because there was a second mortgage, he did a short sale on it. So uh, that's where his problems come in because they are reporting it properly as uh, a loan that was settled for less than the full amount, which is the definition of a short sale. So it so, pretty much comes down to the same as if he had done a short sale on his first mortgage. He has part, a short part, sale lien and... He, uh, I understood that the first mortgage was totally paid off, right? and they did a short sale on the second. So that's where the problem comes in, because the second mortgage holder or mortgagee wasn't paid off the full amount that was owed to them. So mm -hmm. when they reported it to the credit bureau, they reported it as settled for less than the full amount. Right. That becomes a short sale. And then... Subsequent to that, when he goes uh, to buy a new home and purchase that with a mortgage, uh, but feel free to chime in there, but most uh, lenders, depending on the program, uh, are going to require a mandatory waiting period after the short sale occurred. Uh, what, do, what is that period? I deal with, if it's FHA, it's going to be three years, USDA four, and conventional seven. Okay. That's correct. Yeah, we have but uh, in the studio uh, today our mortgage uh, representative in his confirming bill. Yeah, and, and I just heard the other day, to make matters better or worse, depending on how you look at it, that there are some conventional lenders that are are looking, don't have any final word on it, but are looking at cutting that waiting time down from seven years if a person wants to pay a substantially hi higher interest rate and at least 20 percent down. That's right. But so far I don't have any uh, definitive answers on that, but N there's nothing a lot set of talk yet. about that right yeah. now. Nothing set yet, but we're waiting for that. Pardon? Okay. Bill, um, this is Christina. I was curious, how could people get in touch with you and what is your service run on service cost? Okay, uh, I'll answer the cost first. Uh, if a person just wants a comprehensive analysis and plan of action drawn up for them on their credit along with a consultation, I charge a flat $200 fee for that. And for a lot of folks, uh, if you point them in the right direction, so to speak, and give them a good game plan, uh, there are a lot of folks who can take that and run with it. They just don't know where to start or what's involved. For somebody who needs uh, a lot more of our services on an ongoing basis, we have a flat $695 fee, which covers anything that we need to do, multiple consultations, etc. cetera. Uh, we charge $695 for one year. Uh, if they want to get in touch with me, they can either go to my website, which is 
creditdrbill.com. They can call my office, area code 813-655-9451, or they can go to the uh, Jamie Maloney website, and he'll be glad to hook them up with me. We, we definitely will, Bill. Bill, we really appreciate you joining us. We have to go to a break soon, and um, we really just appreciate you sharing all the information, and I will definitely personally pass your info- information on to quite a few of my clients. Thanks so much. It's been a delight to be with you, and uh, I'm going to be listening to the rest of the show for all the good things we're going to hear. Wonderful, wonderful. Thank you again. And you've reached the Jamie Maloney Real Estate Show. Thank you for tuning in. On When we come back from break, we'll be talking to Bud Spriggs and John Mitros with National Renovation. Um, he's the National Renovation Manager at Movement Mortgage. We're going to be discussing home path mortgages and what and how it's going to impact our real estate community with it going away. Today's the last day that someone could actually buy a home path property and obtain a home path mortgage. So lots of great info. And again, you're um, joining the Jamie Maloney Real Estate Show. Thank you. Hi, Jamie Maloney here, your host of the Jamie Maloney Real Estate Show. I want to thank each and every one of you for listening to my show on 1250 Wins, WHNZ. The Tampa Bay real estate market is very undersupplied, and we need inventory. There is strong demand from both first-time buyers as well as large investment groups, and many properties are seeing multiple offers due to the lack of inventory in our area to satisfy this demand. As a matter of fact, the Tampa Bay region is at a seven-year low in available inventory, and demand is at its strongest since the market's peak in 2006. This demand has pushed up values in our area as high as 20% in some areas year over year, and you may be surprised what your home is currently worth. I am offering all my listeners a free home valuation if you text the word VALUE to my cell phone at 813-760-8516. Again, text the word VALUE to 813-760-8516, and I will send you a complimentary and detailed home valuation within three business days of speaking to you. Please reach out to me. I've sold nearly 1,000 homes in the Tampa Bay region and have been in business for almost seven years now. I have the market knowledge and experience to help you sell your home, whether big or small, for top price. Don't put one of your biggest investments into the wrong hands. There are many inexperienced agents in the market, and the wrong decision can cost you thousands in a poorly marketed and poorly negotiated deal. Trust your sale to one of the area's top listing agents and contact me today. In addition to having one of the top listing agents in the area representing your home, you can rest assured that you have the area's number one real estate brand, Coldwell Banker, in your corner as well. Coldwell Banker is an internationally recognized real estate brand and properly markets your home across 500 websites, and we also utilize print advertising as well as all the social networking tools and sites to get your home exposed to a broad audience. Please reach out to me today for a free home valuation. Just text the word VALUE to 813-760-8516. Again, 813-760-8516. Or stop by my website at www.tampabayradio.com and fill out my contact form, and I will get in touch with you as soon as possible. You can also find me on Facebook at facebook.com forward slash Jamie Maloney Real Estate Show. Just click on like to receive show updates, as well as a feed of all my listings and current real estate news articles. You can also post questions on the page that I and the audience can discuss. Thanks for tuning in and be back in a moment. In the market for a reverse mortgage, contact Access Reverse, a local company with personalized service in the Bay Area. Call them at 727-347-0305 or visit accessreverse.com for a no-cost, no-obligation consultation. They'll come to your home and speak with you about the best options for your reverse mortgage. Plus, they offer the lowest closing costs. Don't just get a reverse mortgage. Get the right reverse mortgage with Access Reverse. Visit accessreverse.com. NMLS number 4566. Tampa Bay weather is a roof killer. That's why when getting your roof done, you want it done right. Hi, I'm Jamie Maloney of the Jamie Maloney Real Estate Show. When considering a new roof or repair, talk to Westfall Roofing. 
They've been installing high-quality roofs in Tampa Bay for over 25 years. Get a free, no-obligation estimate by calling 855-99-ROOFING. Find out what already 15,000 satisfied customers already know. Call now, 855-99-ROOFING. That's 855-99-ROOFING. Bud Spriggs and Movement Mortgage want you to experience the thrill of one-day underwriting and the comfort in knowing your loans will be clear to close in record time. While a competition looks to a lost closing date, Bud Spriggs and Movement Mortgage focus on their 12-day clear-to-close. They do this by utilizing their world-class operations staff to underwrite your loan within six hours, process your loan in 12 days, and have your loan closed in time. Underwritten in six hours, cleared to close in 12 days. Bud Spriggs and Movement Mortgage. It's so important to have good credit, from getting a job to getting a mortgage, even giving your children the care they deserve. Bad credit and credit problems can put your future in jeopardy. So talk to Bill Lavender, Dr. Credit. Take control of your future. Get your credit back on the right track and learn how to keep it there. Visit creditdrbill.com or call 813-655-9451. That's 813-655-9451. If your credit scores are on the floor, call Dr. Credit and watch them soar. You're listening to the Jamie Maloney Real Estate Show with local expert, Jamie Maloney. Now, here's Jamie. Thanks for joining us back from our break. This is Christina Griffin and Stella Guticelli is our co-host today. Jamie is away at the Coldwell Banker National Convention in LA. He's having a lot of fun. I, we, I guess you, you were supposed to go there, right? I was. Okay. Uh, I'm nine months pregnant, so needless to say, I wasn't able to travel this late in my pregnancy. So we are covering for Jamie, and um, we really appreciate you tuning in. And uh, we have Bud Spriggs in the, uh, in the showroom and John Mitros, his natural renovation manager at Movement Mortgage. Bud is an expert contributor for the Jamie Maloney Real Estate Show. He's an experienced loan officer with Movement Mortgage and a senior mortgage consultant. Today we're going to talk about home path financing and how it's going to impact our industry with the options going away. Hey, bud, how are you today? Good, Christine. How are you? Oh, you know. <laughs> I, you know, I could never tell. I would have never known that oh, you're nine months pregnant. <laughs> Looking good. I appreciate it. Thanks, bud. Um, so I've worked with Fannie Mae and home path financing for... Gosh, almost 10 years, I feel. And I'm really concerned on how it's going to affect at least my market in mm -hmm. the South Tampa community. We have so many condos that are starting to rebound because of the home path financing and put owner occupants into them. Right. So just curious on your take on how you feel it's going to affect our community and you know, if there's any options for any real estate agents right well, now. There's options. And, you know, overall, I'm not overly concerned. Now, on the condo side, you know, the one thing that we could get, do with condos on the home path was we didn't go need to go through the full condo approval mm -hmm. when somebody was coming out with 5% down. Okay. But condo loans in general, MI, all that, have, have loosened up in the last few months where, you know, before it was 20, 25% mm -hmm. down, that was going to be the way it was. So right? could could you explain for the audience uh, what is the home path uh, home uh, financing? Well, the home path financing option basically oh, was a customer mm -hmm. could get into a property, number one, without an appraisal. So you took that equation out. That, that was the biggie to me. The other part was you didn't need mortgage insurance, but what mm -hmm. people didn't understand was basically the, the home path the rates were a little, you were paying for it one way or the other. And I kept, I, I would try to put that in them so they could at least have a few options and, and make a, a good decision. To me, the home path, the straight home path loan, the biggest feature of that was no appraisal was needed. Okay. So that was one thing you didn't have to worry about. And then the 5% down, and right? Five percent Only 5% down. down. Yeah. But we've got the 5% down on conventional and three and a half with with FHA. Mm -hmm. And right? you didn't have to get the condo approved. The, that, the con was, that was the big one for sellers. That was the big mm -hmm. one on the condo side. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, as you know, a lot of home path homes, uh, you know, some of them need a little work. And mm -hmm. so people would automatically say, hey, we want to go with the, the home path renovation loan. Mm -hmm. You know, at Movement, we offer all up until today, we offered all three of the major renovation products. We offered the 203K, the conventional, what's called the home style and the home path 
renovation loan. Well, the big thing with the home path renovation loan was the straight loan, again, was no appraisal. With home path renovation, you needed to throw the appraisal. The appraisal came back into the equation. So you didn't necessarily take a home path home to a home path renovation loan anyway. Yeah. And you wanted to throw the other options out there. Absolutely. Well, in, in your opinion, though, on a home path type renovation loan, another product <clears throat> that may come into play for that, what type of closing dates should realtors obtain with their clients? Well, that's nice that you yeah. bring that up. And just coincidentally, yeah. <laughs> today we had our, we flew our uh, national renovation manager, Johnny Mitros, down to do some talking, to educate some realtors, because realtors need to know about this product. Absolutely. There's all kinds of different things and different ways they can use this product, and they're not. And uh, with that, you know, I thought, what a great way and what a great time to bring him in. So if you don't mind, I'd like to introduce Absolutely. him. Absolutely. And let him talk a little bit about the uh, the options that are out there. Is that Absolutely. all right? Absolutely. Absolutely. Hey, Johnny, how you doing? I'm doing well. Thank you very much. Thanks Glad for joining us. Glad to be here us. in Tampa. Thank you for joining us. Thank you. Thank you for having mm-hmm. me. Um, any tips you could give realtors on now that home path renovation is going away? Uh, as of today, you have to have an executed contract from Fannie Mae in order to even proceed with home path financing. Mm. What do you recommend for realtors that are looking for home path options, type options for their clients? Well, uh, Fannie Mae, prior to actually having the home path program, the majority of the loans that we did uh, for any REOs per se, which obviously all the things, excuse me, homes or properties on the website are REO properties. Um, the home style program is Fannie Mae's other option. It's it's home style. Okay. I haven't heard of that one. Yeah, and a lot haven't, believe it or not. I actually had uh, somebody make an offer on a property with a home path logo on it, decided to go home style instead because okay. of a better interest rate. A listing agent, and this was a, a different state, wasn't here, but that listing agent, when he saw my pre-approval and it said the financing was subject to home style, not only did the listing agent not know about the home style program, but the uh, property manager at Fannie Mae didn't know what it was, and I had to explain it to them before they accepted his offer. Wow, okay. Uh, and then when he realized that the home style, excuse me, home path was going away, I happened to be doing some training on the West Coast. This was about a week ago. Uh, he said, John, when you get back to New Jersey, um, please come see me right away because we need to talk. So there is a, a big lack of education, and I think one of the reasons is that there aren't that many lenders that actually are approved through Fannie Mae to do the home style program, home style program. Right, versus the... Um, the home path, which there was an association with certain lenders um, and Fannie Mae immediately, and usually it was the larger banks. I look forward to finding out more information about that program when we come back from a short break. Again, you're listening to the Jamie Maloney Real Estate Show. Please join us after the break. Um, please check out Jamie's website at tampabayradio.com, and if you'd like to contact Jamie, please contact him at Jamie at tampabayradio.com and we look forward to you joining us when we come back thank you the following is big news for all men over 50 right now you can try a groundbreaking new prostate support formula called prostorix risk-free prostorix is the answer to help you maintain a healthy prostate and urinary function The proprietary formula in Dr. Formulated Prostorix contains more natural, clinically studied, proven ingredients for prostate health than any other brand on the market today. Prostorix also contains curcumin C3 Reduct, a powerful natural antioxidant and anti-inflammatory. Prostorix is the only prostate brand that has it. John from New York says, I couldn't stay in bed all night without getting up at least one, so I said, I'm going to give it a shot. I'm going to be a customer for life. Try Prostorix, America's premium prostate supplement, risk-free today. Call now for our risk-free trial offer. Pay only shipping and handling. Call 888-204-4468. 888-204-4468. Try Prostorix prostate supplement, risk-free today. 888-204-4468. Dear God, thank you for keeping us safe and healthy. Give us food for tomorrow. We are really hungry. If you can help us find the home, that would be good too. You can be hope for the hungry by supporting Metropolitan Ministries at MetroMen.org. Dear customers, 
Please eat burgers somewhere else. I didn't realize the effect advertising on the radio during dinner time, when all you people are thinking about is food, would have on my business. I've recently developed carpal tunnel from flipping so many burgers. Ow, ow. Sincerely, Susan, owner of the Hindenburger. Susan advertised on the radio and, to her regret, scored a ton of new business. If you wish you had her problem, contact us immediately. Put in keyword advertise at whnz.com to find out how you can get to the right customers at the right places. ABC Pest Control's pest-free home service can rid your home of insects that carry diseases and are a direct cause of health concerns for children. Give your family peace of mind knowing your home is protected from these insects. Call ABC Pest Control today at 877-888-PEST. Need AC? Call Simpson Air, the coolest guys in town. Log on to thecoolestguys.com. This report is brought to you by the Florida Law Group. The lawyers of the Florida Law Group have fought to make a difference for Tampa Bay Area accident victims since 1982. Experience matters. Find out how at thefloridalawgroup.com or call 855-FLA-LAW-NOW. That's 855-FLA-LAW-NOW. From the Bright House Network Traffic Center, the interstates are in good shape at the time. 275 and I-4 moving well through the downtown interchange. No problems for you across the Bay Bridges. Do watch out for an accident reported along Dale Mabry, south of Gandy at Wyoming Avenue. Some minor slowdowns here. There are reports of a wreck along State Road 52 at the northbound I-75 exit ramp. That's all off to the side. See a problem on the roadways? Call the injury firm of Abraham Sin and Uterway Hillsborough Traffic Tip Line at 866-545-9595. <laughs> 12.50 winds, weather center forecast, low 80s this afternoon for the high, lots of sunshine. We'll see lows tonight into the mid-upper 60s, could even still see a few of those 50s uh, well north. Mid-80s return tomorrow, some upper 80s by the midweek, and rain chance pretty much going to hold off all week. Slight chance on Thursday, Friday, about 10, 20%. In fact, radio, 12.50 winds, WHNZ. You're listening to the Jamie Maloney Real Estate Show with local expert Jamie Maloney. Now, here's Jamie. Thank you for joining us back from our break. This is Christina Griffin and Stella Guticelli is our co-host today. Why Jamie is away at the Coldwell Banker National Convention in L.A. He's in the top 10 for NRT and we really congratulate him for his achievement and he's enjoying his uh, time away. Um, today we were are talking to John Mitros, National Renovation Manager at Movement Mortgage and Bud Spriggs. But we're going to just take a quick break from that. And we have Malcolm Tennant, who is calling in to share some information about, about his reverse mortgage company. Um, Malcolm is overseeing the funding of more than a thousand reverse mortgages. Malcolm is also a member of numerous organizations, including the Pinellas Real Estate Association, Area Agency on Aging, Better Living for Seniors, and he has been a big brother since the age of 18. Malcolm, how are you doing today? I'm loving this weather, Christina. How are you? <laughs> same, same as you. I'm a Florida native, born and raised, and always look forward to this um, few months of reprieve that we get. Yeah, I actually had just got done eating some hot soup for lunch. <laughs> so it must be fall. Yeah, and um, and I'm having some hot coffee, so that you know, without ice. So that's it. That's the way I feel as well. Perfect. Perfect. <laughs> Uh, yeah, hey, I, I wanted to mention my son, Scott. Uh, two of my sons and my wife work here uh, uh, at our main office in St. Pete. We've got uh, 11 reps around the state as well, but uh, at our main offices here, Scott um, recently got married, is having his first child. Uh, we got married two years ago, I guess, having his first child in less than a month, and, and he just bought a house, and uh, uh, he needed to put a roof on it, and he got uh, quotes from a number of companies, but he, one of them was Westfall Roofing, uh. who was one of, uh, of Jamie's uh, affiliates. And I, I just wanted to put in a plug for them. Uh, they're the only people that showed up with the, their, uh, the staff in uniform. Uh, they did the quote on an iPad instead of a piece of paper. <laughs> um, their, and their quote was, tw was $20 above the lowest quote he got out of four quotes. So they're very competitive on their pricing. The other company did not have an extended warranty where Westfall offered a, a lifetime warranty included. So uh, they're, I think, putting his roof on this morning, actually. So uh, mm -hmm. it, it's, uh, it's good to know that the uh, it, it's kind of what I like about the Jamie Maloney show is uh, 
it is affiliated with experts. I know Bud is in the studio today, I think. Hello, Bud. How you doing, Malcolm? And uh, uh, hearing Bud talk about he's been doing home paths, I think that's fading, uh, phasing out, but 203Ks, I mean, most companies, if you call most mortgage companies, they'll, they'll probably say they do them, uh, but so many try and do them and lack expertise, and it's good to have an expert like, like Westfall Roofing or like Bud uh, and John in there with them today that really knows this stuff. Uh, when you're buying a house, you want somebody that, that understands the process and is not going to mess up your closing. And uh, John, you mentioned that you had to explain to a real estate agent basically what a 203K is, and we run into that constantly with our reverse mortgage for purchase product. Uh, reverse more. Uh, I, we just we had a real estate agent uh, Thursday uh, placed an offer for a client. They said they were going to use a reverse mortgage to buy the house, and the real estate agent had, had no idea. So we had to kind of educate them, just like you're going through, Bud and John. Uh, the uh, reverse mortgage for purchase is, is for those that don't know is a very simple program. It's just like any other mortgage. Uh, you, you've got to put about 35 to 50 percent down, depending on uh, the age. So it's a pretty substantial down payment. But uh, basically, you're able to buy somebody who has a hundred thousand dollars cash can buy a 200 or 250 thousand dollar house and uh, live there the rest of their life if they choose and never have a mortgage payment. So pretty neat deal, and and that's that's our area of expertise and and. Uh, uh, anybody want, wants uh, further information on that or a traditional reverse mortgage uh, refi, we, we do lots of them. That's, that's all we do. Malcolm, so, uh, how can someone get in touch with you and your company? Well, simplest things, call the office. Everybody here is, is very knowledgeable, uh, myself or whoever answers the phone, really. Uh, it's 727 we're happy to spend time on the phone, uh, explain the process, and, and run through the specific scenarios. There's no cost, no obligation to that. Uh, you can go to the website, too, if you wanted it. It's accessreverse.com, or uh, there's links on Jamie's site as well. Uh, we, anybody uh, who doesn't have free long distance, is, it's 800-806-7126. Uh, Wonderful. Malcolm, I really appreciate you just sharing with us what a reverse mortgage is. It's definitely something that a lot of real estate agents do not hear uh, very often. And hopefully with just creating awareness, you'll be able to uh, bring some new prospects and business to your company that um, just can broaden their business right now. Because I know a lot of uh, clients I work with, they put a great amount of money down and they don't want to worry about payments. And it's just great to know there's other options out there. Yeah, it really is something I, I think you're going to see it uh, come on in the future as more uh, real estate people particularly understand that it's available. Awesome. Awesome. Wonderful. Listen, I really appreciate you joining us. And um, again, um, Malcolm Tennant, he is an expert in reverse mortgages. And please check out the Tampa Bay Radio dot com website or tampa bay reo and that'll give you all the information you need regarding malcolm and his business and uh, how he can help you or your client purchase a home through a renovation mortgage i uh, really appreciate you joining us malcolm and um we'll talk to you later yeah a reverse mortgage a reverse mortgage yes sorry Buzz renovation mortgage i'm reverse mortgage you, you know what i'm gonna i'm gonna blame that on pregnancy brain you know nine months pregnant sometimes get a little tongue-tied so, all right when do you do in a few weeks <laughs> so yeah, uh, scott's wife is due november 1st so that could be about the same time i'm really hoping it happens before then <laughs> so <laughs> i think, I think uh, she is too so. <laughs> yeah all but right. but thank you malcolm and we'll talk to you soon and we really appreciate you calling in Okay, thanks. Sorry. Bye, Stella. Bye, Bud. Bye, John. Bye. Bye. Okay. <laughs> okay um, uh, again, that was Malcolm Tennant, um, and he was talking to us regarding reverse mortgages. We're going to pick up with John Mitros. Um, he's the National Renovation Manager at Movement Mortgage, and he was just sharing with us with some products that can help realtors and buyers that are concerned with HomePath product going away. And what was the product you were sharing with us before you left, before we left the for break? The Fannie Mae product that they have for uh, REO properties and for basically any property in the MLS is the Home Style Program. 
Can you tell us about that? Because sure. I will tell you, I've been selling real estate for over 10 years and never heard of that one. Well, what home style is, it's, I call it the, the baby sister of the FHA 203K because most realtors um, that have been in the business for a while, unfortunately, uh, if you look at me, an older kind of veteran, I started doing 203Ks over 25 years ago. That was the original product that was put out by FHA, which allows uh, a buyer to purchase a home in less than ideal condition. And typically that was REOs. So when I started my business, uh, my uh, referral base was almost 100% REO agents. And as time progressed and housing stocks aged uh, and they got older, um, the market actually has increased. So now we are seeing more and more buyers use both products, the FHA and the conventional product for the uh, purchase, which is an acquisition of a home. And they're being able to not only finance the purchase, but also any repairs or modernization to upgrade the home to make it pretty much the way that they want it their dream home all at one time with one closing and uh, you know in one mortgage and that's really the way it works it's kind of like an a plus b is there a certain loan to value with that program um, fha goes up to 96.5 percent so it's only three and a half percent down how about the home style home style is five percent five percent very similar to the uh, comparable products that they have that are non-renovation so um, there's no overlay if you want to call it or a real major change in the guideline for the uh, approval as far as credit scores, as far as debt to income ratios, everything's really the same. You're just getting uh, the big plus or advantage of getting either it's a modernization of dated or okay. required repairs, which would be an issue maybe on an REO that has distress. And do you have to have an appraisal for that? Product? Yes, you do always have to have an appraisal. Also the benefit though is the appraisal is done not in the as is condition, which is what people are usually seeing, your regular mortgages, FHA and conventional, appraise the house in its as is condition and gives you an as is value. Mm -hmm. Both renovation products give you the after improved value, which is a higher number, nine out of 10 times. Okay. So we're actually lending on the future value of the home after you've already uh, made the improvements, but we're actually doing that before you've made the improvements. So you're taking advantage of future equity at the time of the purchase and that's where the magic comes in where we can lend an extra 10 20 30 whatever it is thousand dollars on top of the purchase price wonderful but do you um also handle those types of loans can people call you directly to get approved yes they can that's them. why that's why i know johnny so well and had him come down here <laughs> awesome but, uh, can you share your information just um for everybody they can get a hold of me at 727-798-3888 or budspriggs.com apply online Okay, and before we go to break real quick, I'd like to know, um, are there any products at all for the condos? <clears throat> We've got the, the regular conventional, okay. up the 95% financing right now. That's, that's kind of a recent thing. Back a few months ago, my companies were staying away from condos, especially in Florida. So we can go up to 95% on a uh, owner-occupied condo getting the condo approval. What if the condo is not approved? Are there any options for... The condo's not approved. We'll probably take them to a what we call a portfolio product. Okay. Non-warrantable condos. There's going to be a lot of different reasons. There's a lot of those that we yeah. work with. Down here there is. And, you know, the customer's got to be strong because we're loaning... At, at that point, we're actually making the loan to the customer on the customer, not so much on the, on the property and okay. what we're using for the collateral. And what kind of loan to value is that? Quite a bit. Just think, think 65 percent loan. Like to value. a hard money type loan. Except better rates. Okay, perfect. Yeah. Well, realtors, at least there's some options out there for you. We're going to have to um, take a quick break. We really appreciate you joining us at the Jamie Maloney Real Estate Show. And again, please check out TampaBayRadio.com for more information. Um, we look forward to you joining us when we come back from the break, and um, we'll talk to you soon. Bud Spriggs and Movement Mortgage want you to experience the thrill of one-day underwriting and the comfort in knowing your loans will be clear to close in record time. While a competition looks to a lost closing date, Bud Spriggs and Movement Mortgage focus on their 12-day clear to close. They do this by utilizing their world-class operations staff to underwrite your loan within six hours, process your loan in 12 days, and have your loan closed in time. Underwritten in six hours, cleared to close in 12 days. Bud Spriggs and Movement Mortgage. It's so important to have good credit, from getting a job to getting a mortgage, even giving your children the care they deserve. Bad credit and credit problems can put your future in jeopardy. So talk to Bill Lavender, Dr. Credit. Take control of your future. 
get your credit back on the right track and learn how to keep it there. Visit creditdrbill.com or call 813-655-9451. That's 813-655-9451. If your credit scores are on the floor, call Dr. Credit and watch them soar. In the market for a reverse mortgage? Contact Access Reverse, a local company with personalized service in the Bay Area. Call them at 727-347-0305 or visit accessreverse.com for a no-cost, no-obligation consultation. They'll come to your home and speak with you about the best options for your reverse mortgage. Plus, they offer the lowest closing costs. Don't just get a reverse mortgage. Get the right reverse mortgage with Access Reverse. Visit accessreverse.com. NMLS number 4566. Tampa Bay weather is a roof killer. That's why when getting your roof done, you want it done right. Hi, I'm Jamie Maloney of the Jamie Maloney Real Estate Show. When considering a new roof or repair, talk to Westfall Roofing. They've been installing high-quality roofs in Tampa Bay for over 25 years. Get a free, no-obligation estimate by calling 855-99-ROOFING. Find out what already 15,000 satisfied customers already know. Call now, 855-99-ROOFING. That's 855-99-ROOFING. You're listening to the Jamie Maloney Real Estate Show with local expert Jamie Maloney. Now, here's Jamie. Thank you for joining us back from the break. This is Christina Griffin and Stella Guticelli, which is our co-host. Jamie Maloney is away at the National Coldwell Banker Convention, which I really wish I could be there right now, but we are hosting his show for him. And uh, we have got Bud Spriggs and um, John Mitros with Movement Mortgage in the um, studio. And John just wanted to share some tips with everyone and Bud regarding the appraisal issues that a lot of, I know myself as a realtor and many of you are experiencing um, that if you open your mind to a few different product options that may be able to help your client and you to be able to close the deal. Absolutely. Um, right before the break, I was mentioning how we use the after improved value uh, with the renovation loans. The FHA 203K has a very specific benefit when it comes to the appraised value. FHA allows us to use actually 110% of that after improved value before doing the mortgage calculation, which is lending the 96.5%. Wonderful. Um, so we do get a 10% buffer, um, or if you'd like to call it insurance policy. Of course, that is only on a 203K. It's not on a regular FHA. So. Uh, it's very often the buyer that's looking at the house is thinking of doing either some major or at least some minor renovations to a house, whether it's minor upgrading of kitchens and baths, anything like that. They're literally putting down a few dollars more at the closing. I'll give you an idea. You can get up to almost $20,000 on a $200,000 purchase. Of It's not free renovations, but it, that's within that buffer. So a home uh, sold for 200000 that might need... Um, Ten to fifteen thousand dollars in renovation does not have to appraise for two ten, two fifteen, two twenty. It can actually still appraise for only two hundred thousand dollars. That extra ten percent makes it affordable, and or would take care of a situation if the appraisal came in low. Okay, That's but interesting. Yeah, it's very I, interesting. I just had a deal like that fall through because I, I, I guess the mortgage company didn't know how to properly structure it. That so is possible. It, working with experts is really important. It's all about the players with, from the referring agent, the realtor, the mortgage exactly. company, the closing agent. Everybody has to be in good hands. It, exactly. Um, I want to mention real quick that, uh, again, today is the last day you have to have a fully executed contract in order to obtain home path financing, and they must close before March 31st of next year. So it's very important to get your financing in line and have some different options for your clients. So uh, the renovation product that John Mitro spoke about, um, I, I'd like to find out, um, does this product work on any of the condos um, or is it just single family dwellings? The, the, yeah, the um, FHA does if it's FHA approved okay. and the um, home style would again, but unlike the home path renovation, we do have to do a renovation survey, excuse me, a condo cert. A now, we do have at Movement Mortgage an in-house condo uh, program and department. So things that are currently not approved, 
can be approved in-house through our condo department, which is completely separate, such as I take care of renovation. We have a special department nationally that approves condo developments in every state that we're in, about 38 states, and um, that gets taken care of very often. So certain markets, um, some realtors are having us pre-approve the entire development up front. I actually got a referral. Again, I, I originate mostly in New Jersey when I'm back home. Um, a loan that went 60 days a week before closing, they told her that the woman... She couldn't close on a condo, um, but they remembered at the management agency that Movement had done one, not through me, but another loan officer, and I was able to close it. No one else, when I'm going to say nobody, but a lot of banks would not close that loan, but they were on our approved list. So there how are possibilities. How quick does it take to get a property approved? Um, on the condo side, I would say probably about three weeks, two weeks. I, yeah. I actually had somebody, um, somebody just sent in. They were It was a listing agent wanted to see if we could get the condo approved before she started marketing it. We turned in all the information, HOA information, and got it actually cleared in about a week. Wow, great. Yeah, that's mm. smooth, but still, that's nice. So I could send you a list of my listings and uh, you could get them approved for us so we can it, market Christina. it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> awesome, you hear that, Jamie, out there in LA? <laughs> We're gonna get those over to Bud and uh, have some great new products available for our clients. Again, um, I appreciate John Mitros and Bud uh, Spriggs from joining us for Movement Mortgage. Uh, Bud, just one more time for the audience, can you just let them know how they could get a hold of you? You reach me at 727-798-3888 or go to budspriggs.com. All right. Thank you again for joining us in the studio. And uh, Yes, and uh, so I'm taking over because I'm uh, going to uh, interview Christina for the, the few minutes we have left. Christina Griffin, um, a realtor at Cowell Banker Residential Real Estate South Tampa office, has been in the business of real estate for the last 12 years. Her area of expertise is the foreclosure market. So what she does is she lists foreclosure properties that inter institutional customers such as Fannie Mae, Freddie Mac, Chase, SunTrust and National Star have on their books. In 2013, she was ranked among the top sales team by transaction sites, uh, coming at number 77 out of the top 250 teams in the country on the Wall Street Journal Real Trends 1000 list. And uh, she transacted uh, 225 um, properties. Uh, Christina, I uh, also know that you're pretty, pretty high ranked in the NRT uh, group. And for those who don't know, NRT is a subsidiary of Relogy Corporation and includes uh, companies such as Cowell Banker, ERA, Sotheby's, Corcoran Real Estate Group. So what's your ranking there? Uh, number seven in units in the number nation. Number seven. Very good. So all of those are great credibility, yes. great, great credentials that gives you great credibility in your profession. And you've built, you know, your business successfully in the niche market of foreclosures. You're one of the top agents here uh, in, our, uh, in our area. And it's really great to have you on the show for this professional and business acumen. But what really makes you uh, special, even more so special as a real estate agent and as a guest today, is that you're a pretty amazing human being. <laughs> you've you. been uh, awarding the prestigious Cowell Banker Hero of the Year Award. Yes. Would you like uh, more to tell us what is the Hero of the Year Award and what do you think you got it? I, I actually was um, lucky enough to receive the first ever Coldwell Banker Hero of the Year Award for the nation, and that was due to all of my volunteer efforts in the community. Mm -hmm. So it was absolutely amazing and um, just thrilled to be able to be recognized. And the company actually last year for receiving it sent me all expenses paid to the Emmys. Uh, oh wow! I remember that yeah, you were so. you were among the stars of uh, of this world, huh? Yeah, yeah. yeah, I I love Coldwell Banker and the brand and uh, just the way they support uh, the agents and recognize you for the things you do in the community. It's it's wonderful, and I don't do it for that reason. So right. it's nice to actually be recognized. I think it's very natural. Yeah, it with is. You. I've seen that. It yes. is. So what about today? Um, I, I know you volunteered a lot for what what, what organizations in the past? Well. Um, I'm sure a lot of you are starting to see hot pink everywhere. It's breast cancer month. So I just wanted to take a quick minute uh, before we end the show and um, 
let everyone know that I am head of volunteer recruitment for American Cancer Society for the Making Strides Against Breast Cancer Walk in Tampa. And uh, if any of you have any interest in volunteering, please email me at Christina C. Griffin at gmail.com. And the event is October 18th at 9.30 in the morning. There's over 20,000 plus people there. Um, and we raise over half a million dollars. It's an amazing event. There's tons for you to do to get plugged into your community and just help create awareness and, um, you know, wear your neon hot pink and you know, definitely embrace and just learn about what brain, breast cancer does. And I know most of you probably know at least one person it's affected in your family or your friend's family. So just a really important cause I'm passionate about. How do we find out more about this, uh, this event? Well, um, you actually, um, you could go to Making Strides Tampa, um, and that is on Facebook, or uh, just Google um, Making Strides Tampa, and the um, link for the walk will come up. Or you could definitely email me at Christina C. Griffin at gmail.com. If you'd like to volunteer, I could plug you in to the event. Very good. So. Thank you so much, Christina, for this information. I have to confess that uh, I was pretty anxious that uh, I would uh, have to finish uh, the show without you because you're very pregnant right now. So I was <laughs> concerned you had to uh, leave during the live show and I had to do that by myself. So I'm well, glad I, uh, we did it all together. Exactly. I was kind of worried about that, but everything's great. And uh, again, you're uh, joining the Jamie Maloney Real Estate Show. Your information source for the Tampa real estate market, check out tampabayradio.com. And thank you for listening.